This is Gene Key, KDD News. MyHighPlains.com reports a man is killed Friday night after being struck by a car while crossing a street. Police say Jesse Clinton Ugly, 71, died at the hospital from injuries he suffered after being struck by a car at the intersection of Martin Road and Dale Street in Amarillo around 7.30 p.m. Police say alcohol and speed were not factors. They are still investigating. An autopsy has been ordered. Newschannel10.com reports Saturday. Fast response time by the Borger Fire Department kept a house fire from spreading through a Borger neighborhood. An abandoned house at Birdie and Fairway that was surrounded by dry shrubbery caught fire and burned to the ground. A neighbor described it this way. The fire at first was small and then grew bigger and bigger. It was so windy. Neighbors and the fire department worked together to keep the flames contained to the home. There were no injuries. The fire department stressed to everyone that with the current winds and humidity, this neighborhood would otherwise be up in flames. The cause of the fire is under investigation by the Hutchison County Fire Marshal. The Associated Press reports a Stratford teen on his school's golf team has died after apparently hitting his head during an accidental fall from a cart. The funeral took place Saturday for 14-year-old Blaine Killian of Stratford. The superintendent of the Stratford Independent School District said Friday that Killian suffered a fractured skull after apparently slipping and falling from a golf cart. The accident happened around 6 p.m. Monday. The boy died Tuesday at the hospital. If you'd like the latest Dumas, Panhandle, and Texas news on your mobile device, you can follow KDD News on YouTube. Simply search KDDD or Gene Key on Facebook or Twitter. This is Gene Key, KDD News.